China and Belarus hold anti-terror military drills on Polish border. Here's a summary of the article. Chinese soldiers have landed in Belarus to take part in anti-terror military drills on the border with Poland. Chinese media said the exercises would be held in Brest on the Polish border. They were greeted by a military brass band which played as the Belarusian and Chinese commanders engaged in the custom of breaking a piece of bread. China and Belarus count Russia as a mutual friend and since the invasion of Ukraine have edged closer together. On Thursday, Belarus was admitted to the Shanghai Cooperation Organization, an economic military group focused on Central Asia and headed by Beijing and Moscow. The Belarusian Ministry of Defense did not give further details about its joint exercises, but China's state-run Global Times reported that they would be held at a training base near the EU border. China and Belarus will conduct joint military training near Brest, it said. One of Belarus's largest military training grounds is situated outside Brest on the eastern bank of the Bug River and opposite the small Polish town of Tereszpol. This post received a score of 3,300, with an upvote ratio of 96%. Here are the top comments in response to this article. Maybe Taiwan can host a joint military exercise with Poland. Watch the CCP screech about raising tensions. I honestly wish the West had the backbone to retaliate against this stuff. We are so scared of poking at them while they are actively slapping and kicking at us. I'm getting to the point where I personally don't care about rising tensions, let them rise. China, Russia, Iran, North Korea are getting way too big for their boots and that's emboldening them. If we don't deliver a swift kick to the nuts then we could end up in hotter water than what we would be if we retaliate now. Retaliate? We perform operations on the borders of those countries so often it's not news anymore. The fact that you aren't paying attention to it doesn't mean it's not happening. Source. I've personally been a part of the exercises. Providing just a few recent and reoccurring examples for the folks who might not be aware. Let me introduce you to a little sometime called RIMPAC. Astral Night, 24 took place in Poland and involved nearly 5,000 people. Sabre Guardian, took place in Romania last year, but rotates around the region. Sabre Strike, started with a road march of US forces, in vehicles, from Germany to Poland. Important to know that, Taiwan isn't the biggest issue. China claims the whole 9-dash line. That is crazy and that is also why we are doing it and we should push harder and show our backbone before it's too late. Whole 9 borders? Are you talking about China's 9-dash line? Because Taiwan has their own 11-dash line. Yeah, but Taiwan also claims all of mainland China. It's not a serious posture. China ACTS on its claims, however. If Taiwan gave up its Chinese territorial claims China would likely see that as an escalation since it's a move towards formal independence. China, are they lost? Nope. They're intentionally undermining Russia's influence in the area. China really isn't allied with Russia in a conventional sense, they're more like the Japanese-German alliance during WW2 where they share some common enemies but neither actually cares to support the other. China likes cheap oil from Russia and the more reliant on Chinese support Russia becomes the closer they get to just becoming a Chinese puppet or proxy, or actively inviting China to annex parts of Siberia that are rich in raw materials. China has no permanent friends or enemies, only interests. Henry Kissinger, S. That's pretty prescient, actually. For the first time since 2013, New Jersey residents are being treated to the city's biggest fireworks celebration this July 4. The 10,000 free tickets Mayor Eric Adams was offering have all been claimed, but a number of venues from the High Line to Hudson Yards are selling fancy $100 plus tickets to their rooftop parties and viewing points. There are still plenty of places to take in the great views for free, no tickets required. This video was automatically created by Reddit to speech. The article and comments in this video were selected from Reddit according to their upvotes, and any paraphrasing was performed by smmry.com, without any human intervention.